Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how fun and easy it is to green screen using the shortcut video editing software. If you find these helpful, please subscribe to my channel. That way you'll know whenever I upload new content. Let's begin. As always, let's give ourselves some room to work. This is the timeline, the work area, adding video track, adding video track. I'm going a little fast because this is a quick tutorial and you should already know how to navigate. If not, I have a video showing you how to use the shortcut editor. So let's start with the background. I picked the beach. It needs to go on the bottom level. Let's put the playhead at the beginning so everything goes to the beginning. Okay, so the beach needs to be at the bottom level. Let's start with the easiest green screen scenario where the green is all perfectly lit, one uniform color. Here we have two different color shapes on top of a green background. I made it in paint, so this is definitely all one green of the same color. So click, hold, and drag that down. Let's remove that. So let's start some green screen action. We have clicked, we have selected this video track. Let this give it a chroma key. I like to use advanced. Let's give ourselves some room to work. We need to be able to see this stuff right here. Because it's so simple, we're going to use this first selection of color space. When we use a non-ideal one, we'll use this other guy. But for this one, it should be easy. Take this dropper, and we're going to pick what color we want to green screen out that we want to chroma key away. We'll click this one. Boom. It's done. See how easy that was? Turn off the filter. Comes back. Turn it back on. Now, what's with these black lines right there? So, for the settings for this, I like to use box, hard, and then minimum. There we are. Use those settings and it will carry you through pretty much every general project. So, let's give it a uh, size, position, rotate, filter so we can move it around there. Now the shapes are over there. Now the shapes are there. Let's bring in another video. It's just some footage of me with not very ideal lighting. Small 11 second clip. There I am making goofy faces. Click, hold, and drag down into the uh, area. It doesn't matter if you put it here or there on top of the shapes, as long as it's not underneath the beach. So we'll just throw that right there. And let's give me some filter. Chroma key advanced. Over here to the second choice because we have shadows. Look at all these shadows. We do not have a nice even green behind me, but we're still gonna make it work. Again, let's go down to our settings. I like box and then hard and then minimum. So now all we have to do is adjust these sliders, push them too far and I disappear. All kinds of weirdness happens. So what we do is, we'll just start right there. Silly me, I forgot to do the most important step. The dropper, let's see, which shade of green do I want to focus on? Let's do this one right here. And let's begin. As artists, we're gonna play with the sliders now. Too much, and you see it starts to take away from my skin color, my face. You want to use as little as possible. So let's move on to the next one. This is a process. If you go too far, okay, that one, nothing happens if you go too far. But still, we want to use the smallest amount that is effective. Because if you do too much, then... See, now we, we have some green over here that didn't get done. It looks like there's some green on my shoulder, so we'll take it back. And then we'll go back to the okay, right there. 
Now we'll go back to the first bar. Sliding forward, sliding forward. Okay, too much takes away my face. And again, this is more work because we're working with non-ideal lighting. Okay, let's leave that there. Let's play with the next one. All right, that looks better. Too much, nothing happens. So, again, we want to use a small amount of adjustment as possible. Otherwise, it'll look choppy and false. So, right there, looks like. A little more. Oh, see, see how it's starting to take away from my shoulder perimeter? So, you definitely want to take it back. We're being artists right now. We're making a creation. And then the third slider. Let's see what we got. We're going slow. We want to use as little as possible. Okay. So this usually happens. You have a nice ratio of, it looks like steps, small, middle, largest. And there we are. I am now green screened. Let's uh, uncheck the filter. There it is. See? So let's make the shapes go for the entire length of the 11 second clip let's make the wallpaper to look here's what happens let me put the play header here i'll hit play and watch what happens when we leave the background we're going to lose the beach now i'm in darkness of space which is kind of cool but the uh, goal of this tutorial is to have to be on the beach the whole time so now when we hit play me making funny faces acting like a fool at the beach with a blue circle and yellow triangle in the sky okay so now the only thing left to do is to uh, export the video but I'm not going to take the time to do that this is a quick tutorial just to show you how to green screen so if you enjoyed this again please subscribe come back see me again soon share this video with your friends take care see you soon